गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट नाउ इन दिस लेक्चर वी आर गोइंग टू सी अबाउट सॉफ्टवेयर नाउ फर्स्ट वन इज वाट आर दिस सॉफ्टवेयर सॉफ्टवेयर रिप्रेजेंट्स द सेट ऑफ प्रोग्राम दैट गवर्न द ऑपरेशन ऑफ अ कंप्यूटर सिस्टम एंड मेक द हार्डवेयर रन सॉफ्टवेयर कैन बी क्लासीफाइड ब्रॉडली इन टू कैटेगरीज फर्स्ट वन इज योर सिस्टम सॉफ्टवेयर सेकेंड वन इज योर अप्लीकेशन सॉफ्टवेयर नाउ इफ वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट सॉफ्टवेयर दीज आर द प्रोग्राम्स आर सेट ऑफ इंस्ट्रक्शन विच इज़ यूज टू परफॉर्म एनी टास्क इन योर कंप्यूटर सिस्टम नाउ फर्स्ट वन इज आर सिस्टम सॉफ्टवेयर द सिस्टम सॉफ्टवेयर दैट कंट्रोल्स इंटरनल कंप्यूटर ऑपरेशन इज कॉल्ड सिस्टम सॉफ्टवेयर दैट मीन्स सिस्टम सॉफ्टवेयर आर यूज फॉर द इंटरनल ऑपरेशन ऑफ कंप्यूटर दीज आर द मशीन बेस्ड सॉफ्टवेयर and system software can further be classified into two categories first one is operating system and second one is your language processor that means first one is your operating system second one is your language processor now operating system an operating system is a program which acts as an interface between a user and the hardware that is all computer resources that means if we are going to talk about operating system OS that means operating system. It's work as an interface between user hardware SW that means hardware SW that means software and other components of computer system. There are many types of operating system present. First one is your single user operating system. Second one is your multi-user operating system. Third one is your time-saving operating system, real-time OS, multi-processing operating system, and distributed operating system. Single-user operating system, you can say that your MS-DOS is a single-user operating system. Now, the types of operating system we have already studied in previous class, like in class ninth, eight, nine, and. so this is not the part of syllabus to discuss here type of operating system now we are going to switch over language processor now language processor are the special type of computer software that can translate the source code into an object code or machine code language processor is also called a language translator that means if we are going to write any program in your computer system then computer can understand only the binary code that means the language of 0 and 1 and we are not going to write any instruction in the binary format that means then how computer would be able to understand our language so that's that's why to resolve this problem we need language translator then language translator is the software which convert the source code into object code and what is the source code a source code refers to the program code written by a programmer in a high level programming language such as in c java dotnet c++ plus plus python etc that means if we are going to write the program in python when we have write int input any number or a equal to 5 c equal to a plus b print c these all are the high level language and the your language processor convert it in this language into machine level language that means into in binary code and that's why an object code refers to a code usually in machine language or binary code so here are here are some of the types of language translator first one is your assembler assembler converts assembler converts assembly language assembly language into machine language or binary code into machine language and next one is your interpreter you all know interpreter python is working on works on interpreter and interpreter converts high level language into machine language or low level language or binary code machine language and the point important point is line by line 
लाइन बाई लाइन दैट मीन्स वन लाइन एट ए टाइम इंटरप्रेटर कन्वर्ट्स हाई लेवल लैंग्वेज इन टू मशीन लेवल लैंग्वेज लाइन बाई लाइन दैट मीन्स इंटरप्रेटर रीड्स वन लाइन एंड एग्जीक्यूट द कन्वर्ट द लैंग्वेज इन कोड इन टू मशीन लेवल लैंग्वेज एंड जनरेट द एरर इफ देर इज एन एरर इन द सिंटेक्स नाउ दिस इज द वर्क ऑफ इंटरप्रेटर वी हैव ऑलरेडी स्टडीड इन आर पाइथन फंडामेंटल चैप्टर नाउ सेकेंड वन इज योर कंपाइलर कंपाइलर कन्वर्ट्स हाई लेवल लैंग्वेज इन टू मशीन लेवल लैंग्वेज इन टू मशीन लैंग्वेज एट वन गो एट वन गो दैट मीन्स कंपाइलर रीड ऑल द इंस्ट्रक्शन ऑल द कोड ऑफ हाई लेवल लैंग्वेज एंड कन्वर्ट इट इन टू ऑब्जेक्ट कोड दैट मीन्स मशीन लेवल लैंग्वेज मशीन लैंग्वेज एट वन गो एक ही बार में कंपाइलर सारे कोड को रीड करेगा और एग्जीक्यूट करा देगा उसको सोर्स कोड में मशीन लेवल लैंग्वेज में एग्जीक्यूट कर देगा बट इन केस ऑफ इंटरप्रेटर इंटरप्रेटर रीड्स वन लाइन एंड कन्वर्ट इट इन टू मशीन लेवल लैंग्वेज नेक्स्ट कन्वर्ट सेकेंड लाइन एंड कन्वर्ट इट इन टू मशीन लैंग्वेज बट कंपाइलर रीड ऑल द कोड इन वन गो एंड कन्वर्ट इट इन टू मशीन लेवल लैंग्वेज नाउ अवर नेक्स्ट वन इज अप्लीकेशन सॉफ्टवेयर अप्लीकेशन एंड अप्लीकेशन सॉफ्टवेयर इज द सेट ऑफ प्रोग्राम नेसेसरी टू कैरी आउट ऑपरेशन फॉर ए स्पेसिफिक अप्लीकेशन और टास्क देर आर मेनी सम टास्क विच We have to use application software. That means the system software are not are not sufficient to perform all type of task. That's why we need application softwares. So application software can be further subdivided into four categories. First one is your packages, utilities, customized softwares, and developer tools. Now, first one is our packages. Packages are the general application software that is used by individual user in manner it suits their needs and requirements. For example, our word processing software, spreadsheet software, database management system softwares, and desktop publishing software, and graphics, multimedia, and presentation applications. These are the software package. Now, next one is our utilities. Utilities are those application program that assist the computer by performing housekeeping functions like backing up disk, or scanning, cleaning viruses, or arranging information, etc. Utilities are the those application programs or software which assist the computer or your system to work properly and in efficient manner, like backing up your disk, data backing करना, data का backup बनाना. सिस्टम स्कैन करना वायरस को रिमूव करना इंफॉर्मेशन को अरेंज करना दी जा सम कॉमन टास्क फॉर यूटिलिटीज सॉफ्टवेयर नाउ सम इम्पॉर्टेंट यूटिलिटीज आर बीइंग डिस्कस बिलो फर्स्ट वन इज योर टेक्स्ट एडिटर दिस यूटिलिटी प्रोग्राम इज यूज फॉर क्रिएटिंग एडिटिंग टेक्स्ट फाइल लाइक योर नोट पैड वर्ड पैड नोट पैड प्लस प्लस इटी सेकेंड वन इज योर बैकअप यूटिलिटी दिस यूटिलिटी प्रोग्राम फैसिलिटेट द Backing up of your disk. That means duplicating the disk information in case of damage or data loss. Third one is your compression utility. This utility program facilitate compre- compression of files. That means compression. That means convert a large file can be converted into small files. Your next one is your disk defragmentator. Disk defragmentator. When it becomes too large for your computer to store in a single location on a disk, when this happens, your computer split the file. That means it converts large file into small file. Now, next one is your customized software. This type of software is specially created software according to business requirement. This is developed. to meet the general requirement of a business or any organization this can be customized software based on the organization's or client's need for instance inventory management system or stock management system payroll system financial accounting hotel management reservation system and etc other customized softwares now our next one is developer tools 
when programmers develop software and programs they have a pre written set of code function or script or classes available to do a variety of tasks for example software li libraries like numpy numerical python library matplotlib lib library scientific python library these are the some developer tools when you are going to import any file or install your any packages or software libraries these are the types of developer tools by using these these tools we can create or design the new softwares so this is all about your software and now i hope you have understand all the concept clearly so thank you for